All right, here we are at the Independence Grove Forest Preserve to new launch. You can see uh, that you can drive into the gatehouse. Make sure you stop there first to check in, and then you're going to veer left, and you'll head all the way to the star where it says canoe launch. And that'll give you access to the Des Plaines River. Access to the Canoe Launch parking lot is parking lot J for Jack in the Pulpit. It's a one-way drive, so you'll have to pass the exit before you get to the entrance. You'll turn left and find an area to park. Here's what the launch looks like. It's a little bit steep and a little bit muddy, so just be careful. Okay, one of the proper ways to get into the river at this launch, you'll notice there is a pretty fast current. But the safe way is to put both hands on the sides or the gunnels of the canoe. And then you want to step into the center line, keeping your center of gravity low. So keep your body low as you enter your canoe. You can see Paul stays on his knees, so he's lower into the boat. And he's going to demonstrate some different maneuvers on the river for us today. So we'll watch him as he goes. He likes to play in here because there's a current and you can do different types of maneuvers like eddy turns and peel outs and ferries. And ferries are what are going to get you across the river in a straight line. So what he did right there was just eddy turn so he could get himself out of that current. What he's demonstrating now is a ferry. You can see how he gets himself pretty much straight across, except when he hit that current a little bit and had to make some adjustments. So that's the tricky bit about the Independence Grove canoe launch. There is this current that if you get caught in it and you're not sure what you're doing, you might end up downstream very quickly before you were ready. But it is a fun place to play and practice your river maneuvers. 